Hey, Don Copeland here, and today we got another pro tip for you on the 12H2. Have no idea what we're gonna call this, so I'm just gonna try to describe it to you, but if you've been using your machine enough, this has probably happened to you. I just wanna show you a quick way to take care of it. So as you're printing, you know, your film is coming through here, powder is building up on the film, and then that film drops down below a laser, and that laser is what causes the take-up reel to advance the film. So there's gonna be some time you're sitting there going, it doesn't seem like my take-up reel has been advancing as quickly as I want to. So sometimes I'll show you what happens and we're gonna to try to sh show you this as best we can. If you see in here, this piece that's sticking out right here, it's kind of a little ledge and what that's doing is underneath of there is where our laser is at. You see the red around my finger. That's where the laser that shoots across is, that gets tripped. However, this is a pretty good ledge. And sometimes I've seen powder build up on the film and it catches back here. And so what's happening is the printer is pushing forward and there's no take up from the back because we're not dropping down to here. So the easiest way to take care of this instead of messing around in here is to physically come to the back of your printer and just take the reel and just, just turn it an inch or two. And what that will do is it'll pull that powder, that pile of powder and the film forward off of that so it drops down and it's back in where the laser can pick it up, and then you're back to, back to normal and you're running as you were. So I know it's a, kind of a weird thing to describe, but it will happen. So when you get it, when you have that come up, make a quick turn on this, and you're good to go. For more pro tips, follow and subscribe. For more information on direct to film, call Kuldesi at 877-793-3278.